Hi there, I'm Lauren and welcome back. Today is 125 and we're talking about cats for the most part. Hanging out with the yoga ladies after aerial yoga, we got on the subject of cats and a lady that I don't know well yet, but I will soon, uh, was saying that she has a cat that looks like it has a beard and so she named the cat after a drag queen that sings and I have never heard of this person but uh, I googled it and it's Conchita and um, I just I really want to see a picture of this cat I'm, I'm sure it's just adorable with the with the beard like a drag queen singer and then another lady also has a cat I didn't see a picture of her cat yet I'll try to get a picture next time but she said that um, she doesn't know where the name came from I think it was a rescue um, but she said it was spelled and I think I misspelled it here in my drawing I think she said it was spelled O-Z-A um, but I will get more information on this cat story this is just scratching the surface um, I do like a good cat story and then Nikki showed me some old pictures of when she first got Mr. Hinkle. And uh, he was just a little kitty, just a little kitten. And uh, he's got a birthday coming up, like I said before, and then she has a birthday coming up also. So there will be a lot of celebrations going on in the next few days, and I'm hoping I'll get to meet him soon. And then it seems like whenever there's a group of cat ladies, there's always a dog lady. And they're all kind of mm, not as enthusiastic uh, as the cat people are. But uh, and yeah, I don't get that. I kind of, you know, I want a dog eventually. I've, I've always had cats, but I don't have any animals right now. And I'm looking forward to getting a dog and I know what I want and I've already got a name picked out so I will have a dog and a cat I think I think I want both and I think they will be big friends so after aerial yoga I went to I was starving and so I found this cafe that's sort of a hole in the wall called Chantilly and I ordered an Americano and the club sandwich with an egg so this, this club sandwich has an egg and smashed avocado. And I thought, oh, that sounds really good. I kind of haven't been eating a lot of protein lately, so that would be good. And it came out and it was so big that they had to have this wooden steak stuck down in the middle to kind of keep it all together. So that was a lot of fun. With just a few little potato chips, just enough to be mm, just right. Anyway, that was a fun place, and I, I think I will go back and take some friends. They have some red velvet pancakes that I really want to try. And then I talked to my friend Mary last night, and she's in California. And she's got a, a pretty recently new boyfriend named Dominic. And he has, uh, has been living in downtown L.A., but he is looking at buying a place or getting a place down in Long Beach, which is where Mary lives. So he is going to be staying with her while he kind of figures some things out temporarily. So I would like to know, what are you doing today?